but you go out and you and and uh, are sending out and uh, funding fundraising solicitation saying we got to get this guy. I'm sending fundraising solicitations because in, in case Missourians missed it, there's been about 15 million dollars worth of negative advertising run. Um, by outside money in Missouri, trashing my record and distorting my record uh, since last October. But so Senator, unfortunately, Senator. I have to raise a lot of money. I wish I didn't. I'd love to just be doing this all day, every day. Uh, this is the part of the job I love, uh, sitting down and having real conversations with people that need real help. And that's my favorite part of the job. My least favorite part of the job is calling complete strangers and asking them to send me checks for my campaign. Senator, In fact, you, my staff right now wants me to leave here to go do call time. Right. I don't want to go do call time. Senator, you complain about the process, but yeah, but but yet you're you're using it for that. You, of you course. Take, you know, so I mean, you can't have it both ways. Well, I I do in that um, this is the system I'm saddled with. I have to raise money from as many different places as I can to try to keep up with an unprecedented flow of outside money into Missouri, and we don't even know where it's coming from. And does uh, Congressman Aiken's decision today to remain in the race affect your ability to run this race? How does it affect it? Uh, I, I, don't, I think that we, um, since the day that Congressman Aiken won the primary, we've been working to contrast our records and make sure Missourians know where the differences are between uh, Todd Aiken and his beliefs and my beliefs. And so we've planned that campaign and we're going to execute that campaign. And it's going to be all about um, student loans and veterans benefits and Social Security and Medicare, uh, accountability, uh, being careful with taxpayers' money. And we're going to keep doing that week after week after week for another 70 some days. And then the voters will have a chance to decide. And, re and, and, and reproductive rights? Uh, all of it. Um, there's contrasts on many, many subjects. And so that would be one of the things that we have a difference on. But um, it's a long list of things that we have difference of opinions. Todd Aiken's um, views on many subjects are outside the mainstream. And we want to focus on all of those um, because many of them are very important to Missouri families. And I want to make sure that while he is a pleasant and sincere man, uh, his views are not pleasant. Uh, for most Missouri families, and that's what I want to focus on. If you had a vote, would you prefer that he stay in or stay out? I don't have a vote. Um, the people have a vote, and the people have voted. They have voted by a very comfortable margin that um, they want Todd Aiken to represent them in this election, and so he and I will have this race, and we will discuss the differences we have, and then the people will have another vote, and they'll decide whose voice they want in the United States Senate. Thanks, everyone.